Hello, today I want to share idea 72 to send it uh, rather train uh, rather train a creator fashion. How does it work? This is the idea 72 to send it uh, rather train. This is the rather better and auto pilot your creator. And this one is the our our rather train a creator. This is the rather train control switch and the this is the radar train allegation in the engine warning display in the flight control session. Uh, this is a core avionic cabinet to control the radar train, radar train accurator. And if you press the your damper, switch on the flight guided control panel. And then uh, this will manual control for your uh, radar train accurator. So the main purpose of this tutorial is the how to simulate the aircraft schematic manual with the British solver. So let's go to the solver here. See here. This is the British professional solver. It can be used for electric, electronics, for programming, or whatever. Um, but I will simulate. I will show you how to simulate the rear aircraft segmented manual with this solver. Okay. Um, here. Let, let us see the aircraft segmented manual. Here. This one is the idea some uses and it radar train accreda schematic schematic re aircraft schematic. This is the radar train accreda here you see this is the uh, DC motor train DC motor one and two but uh, in this case radar train accreda only this motor is used okay this one here this is the synchro for our Radar train position indication. This is the synchro here. This is the position indication on the EWD. The synchro sends signals to the CAC then and into the EWD for your indication. It have the two limit switch, limit switch left limit switch and the right limit switch. If the motor rotates to the left direction, uh, left direction and then our micro switch. Uh, Close and uh, connects to the ground signal. In this condition, uh, our motor is stop it. Then you set a, a, a radar string crosses to the right direction, and your motor work continues working in this stop by the right limit switch by connecting the ground signal and the system ground from the switch here. This the this is. Ground signal from the radar train control switch, and this ground signal uh, for the actuator radar train accreditor. So, I have the two session. This is the radar train control switch. We have the two session upper and the lower. We have the two control switch. This uh, the lower one, radar train control switch control. This one, this one. This switch and this switch. The upper radar train station control the this upper one and this 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 one. So if if you move both switch to the left or right, what will happen? For other way, if you want to move the radar train switch to the right direction, this switch and this one upper one and lower one will operate uh, at the same time. And if you want to move radar train to the left direction. Uh, control set to the left direction this switch and this one will operate simultaneously good so uh, and then this com control this uh, this control signal goes to the our train accreditor here this is the power here this is the green power line goes to the motor and another side is the ground line here, another, another side is the ground line. 
This ground information is taken from the radar train control set. Here, this is the radar train control relay. This the radar train control relay is controlled by the CAC auto binary control application located on the CPN here. When you switch on the here is the auto panel auto fly your number engaged up. That's why when you switch the your number switch located on the fly guide control panel, this radar train control switch is energized. In this condition, you cannot control radar train switch fine manually. Here you cannot control radar manually because uh, if if you press the your number uh, switch on the fly guide panel, this really energized. Here energize and this radar, radar train is controlled by the here is the radar train uh, radar power train box. This is very different area 72 500. This radar train box not included in the area 72 500. This is the 600. 600 control the left radar train left direction or the right direction is controlled by the radar train box automatically radar train box. And in order to energize this radar train control relay, we have to press the your number press button located on the fly guide control panel, and then control from the radar train control box to the our radar train accurator. Now this is the uh, normal operation of the our radar train accurator function. This is the relay secondary unit. Okay, uh, no, it's not important. I just want to say the, the just want to run the this simulation. Radar train set, radar train control relay, and DC motor, and limit set. Okay, let's go to the this solver. Okay, now we are we are ready. Okay. Um, so here, yeah, this is the radar condition. I will run simulation. I will press the radar condition to do the left simd. Here, yeah, this should work together. You see. Oh, here. Yeah, sorry. Uh, in this condition, because we already pressed the radar, uh, your number set, we had to switch off this one. Okay, here. You see, our radar train equator work um, rotate to the counterclockwise direction. You see, counterclockwise direction. And then, if you, you after move this radar train position and negation to the required direction, you can start here. This one, this one. Okay. And then if you want to move the right direction here, you see, this is very different. Rotates to the crosswise cross -wide direction. If you reach the required direction, you can stop here. That's why you cannot, you cannot switch the radar train set only left, only upper switch or lower switch or separate direction, you cannot do. For example, if you only move the uh, lower one like this, this this motor uh, cannot operate. Yeah, it can operate. All right, it can operate. We have to we have to move this radar train control set at the same time. Okay. So how how limit it what? Okay. Now let's go. Now our train control set working to the left direction. For example, in this, for example, in this, in this condition, yeah, this the power, yeah, this the power, goes to this way, power, and this one is the ground line. This also power in ground. This motor DC is working. In this condition, this the right limit switch. You see, stop here, because the radar is uh, this. Limit switch in radar train accreditor are connected mechanically inside the accreditor accreditor assembly. Here, and it's working and then it's ready. If if this motor reaches to the required direction, 
and this limit will stop the rotation or direction here this is the ground signal this is the ground so ground ground this will not stop yeah okay so next one is you want to move back to the left direction from the way yeah rotation is the right what else will be different opposite direction and opposite direction here in this condition our limit set at this stop this ground signal and oh here is the ground oh, here hit this line ground and ground this motor stop the rotation okay and then you want to back to the another direction see here yeah. and then the press and start the motor like this this is the normal normal train operation by manually to the right train accurator but if you want to switch on the your dumbbell switch Located on the fly guide to the for your autopilot operation. For example, this working like this. And this, if you switch on the your dumbbell switch here, yeah, this stop. Because no no sickness to the you are uh, train accurate. Because if you are um, switch on the your dumbbell fashion, this train you are is controlled by the from this line. This line is come from the uh, power train box, the autopilot. Auto by law, auto logic inside the CBM. This is the automatic automatically control on ADS 72 600. That's why when you want to move the radar radar train by manually switch you switch off the your number like this here. Okay, like this. But this your number switch control by the auto by law application CBN. CBN and the left direction or right direction is controlled from the power train about this line. I did not draw this fashion from in this committed here. You see this two line, this two line came from the uh, power train box. This is the power train box to control this relay controlled by the autopilot application inside this uh, C C CBN yeah it's a CBN this is and that's it okay uh, this that's why I want to share if you uh, want to understand or if you want to study the aircraft committed to manual manual you can use this uh, process so well this is very simple and easy just drift and drop and connect and run the application because for your uh, uh, aircraft beginner, beginner it, is, uh, it is maybe difficult to study the aircraft committed manual that's why I just sharing this survey and how to simulate the aircraft committed okay thanks for watching to my channel if you like the channel please subscribe my channel